Hey guys, this is your trusted weather forecast, and today we're going to be talking about likely major Hurricane Laura that will be impacting Texas and Louisiana and other portions of the Gulf in the middle of the week around Wednesday to Thursday. Right now, the National Hurricane Center has us peaking at a Category 2 hurricane. Before we get into this, I'd like to ask you to subscribe. About 75% of you who watch my videos are not subscribed. So please click the subscribe button if you like weather-related content. Hit the notification bell if you do not want to miss a single upload. Also, share this with friends and family and like the video to get this out to as many people as possible. Let's get right into this. The National Hurricane Center has mentioned themselves that their forecast is conservative meaning they're holding it back a little bit. And if they weren't being so conservative on their forecast, we'd likely be seeing M's all over the place here for a major hurricane. I do expect this to peak at Category 3 or Category 4 strength before making landfall somewhere between the Texas and Louisiana border. These are hurricane force wind speed probabilities. That yellow there is 30 to 40% impacting Louisiana and portions of Texas along that border there. This is the greatest flash flood risk over the next three days. You see that red in Louisiana there is a moderate risk for flash flooding. So things could get very dangerous in Louisiana flood-wise and storm surge-wise. This is current forecasted rainfall from Laura. You do see that orange there, 6 to 10 inches in a narrow corridor in Louisiana. Otherwise, that yellow is 4 to 6 inches of rainfall. Quite a bit of rainfall, I must say. Intensity guidance for Laura has it all over the place. Some do not have it going into major hurricane status, which I believe is likely because of how warm the Gulf the Gulf is. It it's going to be a major hurricane. I know it will be. Um, whether that's a low end category three or a high end category three, that's still a major hurricane um, before it ends up rapidly weakening after impacting land. These are some of the paths it could take. Models are slightly split. The storm has been tracking slightly more south than forecasted recently. Um, before it was expected to rip right through the middle of Cuba, but it's actually going to the south of Cuba and over water. So that could also be worse for the Gulf because it can get that extra water and their extra strain. Um, however, it these models range from a landfall around New Orleans all the way through near Houston, Texas, anywhere in between there. But most of them do agree on a central Louisiana landfall. That's your Chester weather forecast for likely major Hurricane Laura. Make sure to like, subscribe, leave a comment if you want. Goodbye.